So the Eastern Cooperative Oncology Group is one of the uh, four adult cooperative groups that are involved in conducting trials for patients with cancer. And I'm happy to say that the Thoracic Committee at ECOG is in the forefront of developing targeted treatments for patients with molecular targets, treatment options for patients who do not have a fully defined molecular target at this point. We're invested in understanding and improving treatment options for patients with every stage of lung cancer, small cell, non-small cell lung cancer. Now, if you move to stage three lung cancer, uh, there's a lot of controversy on what's the best way to take care of patients with stage three lung cancer. Should they have surgery? Should they have chemotherapy followed by operation? Should they have chemotherapy and radiation and not have surgery? Or should they have all three? So this has been an ongoing controversy for a long time. Uh, one study that we have in development is to use PET scan to identify which are those patients who might need more aggressive treatment or who may be just fine with what you're doing. So this study will basically get a PET scan for patients with stage three and they will start chemotherapy. And as soon as they get the first treatment in three weeks, we'll get another PET scan. And we're gonna see if that change in glucose uptake in the tumor and the lymph nodes can tell you which patient is going to be just fine with continuing the same chemo and who is not. So if you find out somebody is not going to do well, then you can change plans and adapt to that information and go with the more aggressive approach, perhaps adding chemo and radiation to see if that would be a better way to improve cure for those patients. So that's a study that we are uh, uh, in the developmental phase. We plan to have it uh, available in the next few months.